Everyone's Matt with ConvertKit, and I want to show you how we set up these webinar pages with lead pages and YouTube Hangouts and chat roll. So what we're going to do first, I'm just going to walk you through what I do for the workshop is come on over to YouTube and you're going to go into your creator studio. It's the first thing to do that I like to do. Come over here to live streaming. And we're going to go to events. So I want to set it up beforehand. New live event. Go ahead and name it. This one is going to be November 10th. Who's going to be president for this one? It's November 8th, 2016. A date that will live. Well, it'll live. All right, so we're going to set the time, set an end time. It's not for today. There we go. We'll set it for three. It doesn't really matter, like in terms of starting what time you set this for. It's more for people who come on and uh, just want to get an idea. So I'm not going to do anything with the description. We're just going to do quick using Google Hangouts on air. Go ahead and create the event. And let's go ahead and find it. November 10th, getting started workshop. Just going to click on the, the main page. So got a couple of days before it starts happening. And we're going to come to share and embed. And we're going to grab, you would grab this entire embed code. But right now, let me go over to lead pages. So here's the work, weekly workshop. I'm going to wait for this to load. So like I said, you can grab this entire uh, bit of, of iframe code. And right here, the video embed is saved. So what you would do, and this is just a particular uh, page in lead pages that we like to use, have used. So all you need to do is click here and embed, and you can see it's the same iframe. What I want to do, though, to point out is all I'm going to do is grab this part, because this is the only thing that changes. This is like basically the ID. As you can see, everything else is the same, you know, all this other stuff. And so I'm just going to swap that out leading up to this question mark right here. Okay, so I'm just going to swap that. The reason that I want to do that is you notice this. The only thing that's not there is this question mark autoplay equals one. And what that is, you can see that that doesn't exist right here. What that does is pretty much exactly what it describes is that it will autoplay your video when, if it's live, when someone comes in to the page. So we're going to go ahead and save that. The chat role, you can use chat role, you can use chat tango. There's a bunch of different things, but basically it's just an HTML block and we've dropped the HTML in here. So that's all you would do. If you had a button, a call to action button, you would put that link in there, any of your social share. Yeah, this, then it's just a regular lead page. So I've already changed all this. Each week, all I do is I go in and basically just switch out this bit of the video ID. That's all I do. So we're going to update that. Okay. And if you come over here now, so this is the old page, you can see with this, you know, kind of ridiculous picture. I think I'm wearing the same shirt. That's embarrassing, but all this is set up. Now, I don't know if it'll show right away, but let's see if it updated. Yep. Nope. It didn't. So um, this will update shortly, I'm sure, but yeah, so let's look at the look at it on the lead pages side. See, it's updated here. So this is what they'll see. This is why you set it at the exact time so that they can just see it's this long until it starts. But you can go in to you can go into the lead page, or what you would do to get it started now is when I was ready, and I could do this at any time. But when I was ready, what I would do is again I'm going to come back over here to actually I could just go back a little bit. Yep, live events. So right here, I would click on Start Hangout on Air, and then that would be it. Then I would be off to the races. So hopefully that was a helpful little uh, piece of a walkthrough for you. If you want to do this for your own webinars, it's it works pretty well. And you sometimes have to deal with some Hangout issues, but it works pretty well. It's obviously very affordable, and yeah, you don't have any limits on the number of people that you can have on these Hangouts either. So people chat right here. That's all done through Chat Roll. You can use Chat Tango. There's a couple of different options. But that's how you set up a Google Hangout slash YouTube Live, whatever it's going to be, and lead pages. That's all you do.